Hey guys, this is Zach from the Urban Hydroponic Grows Union. I'm over here at Chuck E. D's house showing you our auto pot setup that we put on uh, the porch. We got these peppers out of an indoor grow. And so right now we have them, you can see they're enduring a little bit of transplant shock, but we have them under the screen on the porch so that they don't get direct sunlight for the first couple of days and then we'll probably move them out to the greenhouse. I'm going to walk out there and give you a quick tour of what's going on in there. We're pretty excited about it. As you can see, the tomato plants are reaching for the sky. We've topped them and we're probably going to start uh, letting another tre uh, trellis, you know, another vine grow on each one. These are our mortgage lifters starting to ripen. You can see this one over here is almost there, turning pink. Got a second truss on the way. Also got our uh, cherry tomatoes. They're the sun gold variety. You can see that these plants are just laden with fruit just all the way up the vine. Got three of those in here. And then we also got our little mamas right there start just now starting to ripen you can see that each plant has got three or more trusses on the vine so we are very happy with the growth of the tomatoes in this system it's just a cocoa core with the base of sure to grow and then it's fed by an auto valve which is what encourages us to buy the auto pot system uh, because it was more expensive to build this ourselves than it was to just buy auto pots so we're going to do that in the future. And then also here we got some uh, cayenne peppers that are just being hand watered in a pot with cocoa. And you can see that they are producing extremely abundantly. There's just peppers all over these things. And then also we got the raised bed going on. You can see we tried to transplant these peppers out here but they were a little bit too old and Every day when the sun comes out, they just wilt, which is what inspired us to put the other ones on the porch under the shade for a while. But these pepper plants back here are doing pretty good. You can see you got some jalapenos on the vine here, pretty good number of them. Starting to get pretty big. And also some Caribbean red habaneros. Got a pepper on the vine there as well. Where's it at? There it is. Also got our carrots coming along beets and the radishes we've been harvesting radishes for over a month now I love chomping on those things there's our little compost pile that we put all our trimmings in 